This tool is used to export AutoCAD objects in GML Inspire format. In order to send information to the national cadastral services of the European Union, the parcels can be defined by associative hatches or by any type of polyline. If we use hatches, they have to be associative hatches, and they have to be defined using the method add, select objects. The selections are cumulative, so that the objects are accumulated in the table. To remove all the objects, use the Reset All button. To get the GML file, use the Export GML button. To close the tool, we use the Close button. In the last column, is shown the cadastral identifier of the plot, which is generated automatically. However, we can change the identifier just editing the cell. Once the GML file is exported, we proceed to its validation in the cadastra. If the hatch has arcs or the plot is defined by a polyline with arcs, we have to specify in the settings that we want to get interior points from the arcs. We also have to specify how many points we want to get from each arc. In all objects, the app check if the first vertex coincides with the last one. If not, the app will close the polygon by itself. Thus, an open polyline with 22 vertices will appear in the table with 23 vertices. The table displays information about each object, such as the number of vertices, the layer it belongs to, the type of object, and its area. To add holes to a parcel, we define the outer perimeter of the plot by selecting any of the allowed objects. In the table, we select the row of this object, click the right mouse button, and click on Add Inner Objects in the Context menu. Next, we select in AutoCAD the objects that define the holes. These holes will be shown in the table indicating in the interior to column that they are interior to the first object. Finally, we use the Select button to add the holes as independent plots or island parcels. In the second method, we must choose hatches that already has the island parcels defined. It is important to know that only exterior objects generate parcels, whether they have holes or not. Interior objects do not generate parcels. Given the case that there is a surrounding plot, with several island parcels inside that follow one another contiguously. We must first define the surrounding plot and add the hole formed by the joint outer perimeter of all the island plots. Next, we add all of the island parcels to the table as exterior objects. This procedure can also be carried out using hatches. To identify in AutoCAD the objects of the table, we select a row of the table, press the right mouse button, and select the Identify Object button in the context menu. The app will zoom in the object on the AutoCAD screen. For more information about this tool, you can read the manual, whose link is in the description. Thanks.